Niyak ako. Hey guys, it's Nish and welcome back to another episode of Nash and Nish Vlogs. If you're new to our channel, please do not forget to like, subscribe, and click the notification bell button to get notified every single time we upload a new vlog. I'm going on a date tour to Interlaken in Switzerland. I will be riding a train from Frankfurt to Switzerland and then Switzerland to Frankfurt. This was kind of last minute, just randomly had the urge. Switzerland is really one of my dream destinations in life. Basically, I don't have anything else planned except for paragliding. I booked it for 3.30 p.m. later. It's 160 Swiss francs. So that doesn't include yet the photo and video if you want because that's a top up. But other 40 Swiss francs. So Switzerland, they don't have euros. They have Swiss francs, but they do accept credit cards. It is currently 3.12 a.m. Then I'm going back home at around 11 p.m. So the travel time is around 4 to 5 hours. I think 5 hours going and then 5 hours going back home. But yeah, I'm very excited. This is really my dream destination and I can't wait for you guys to see it as well. Hey guys, I just made it to Interlaken in Switzerland after five and a half hours of traveling and two train transfers. I'm finally, finally here. I'm first going to Arderkulm. I'm trying to figure out where it is. I'm going there and going to see the view of Lake Thun and Lake Brienz. And let's see how this goes. This is the entrance to the Handerbahn, which is where we will buy tickets for the harder comb. Hi, one round trip ticket, please. Okay. Round 40 trip. francs, please. <laughs> Let's see the other side. This 
So guys, Harder Kulm is something that you shouldn't miss when you come to Interlaken. It's 40 francs for the Harder Ban. Yung malit na bus train papunta here for round trip already. Well, it's kind of expensive. It's around 2,000 something pesos. But it's worth it. The view is really nice. There's also a restaurant if you wanna eat here. But I made baon because I'm tipid. Grabe yung view. Like you see Interlaken. And then you see Lake Brienz and Lake Thun. So it's interlocking because it's in the middle of two lakes basically. It's so beautiful. I met someone who was willing to take my pictures. She's also Filipina. So that's really nice. Like you get to also meet people who are traveling by themselves. Okay, so now I'm gonna go down now because I've maximized my time here. Another cheap option is you don't take the harder ban, but you hike 1.5 hours going up and 1.5 hours going down. So if you're really saving, then you can just hike. That's where we came from. I will now go back to the train station see what I can find there. I just got my ticket because I'm going to Interlochen West. I bought a ticket from the ticket station and I bought it at around 1 but the train leaves at 1.30 pa so I'm just alone resting because it's super hot outside and even on top of the harder gloom it's super hot. I mean it's breezy sometimes but it's really still hot so I'm just chilling and buta na lang there's aircon here. Going to Interlock and West. I was supposed to go to Lake Brienz, pero parang di na abot yung train, so probably won't na lang. I don't wanna risk it anyway as well. So most important sa akin yung paragliding. And I mean, I already saw the two lakes and I saw the parang connecting lake naman then. So I'm pretty sure that's how it looks like, and that's the color of the lake as well. By the way, I forgot. So my ticket is 3.30 Swiss francs. Um, if you don't have a discount card, it's 3.30 talaga. Pero if you do, it's around 2.30. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! They're landing, they're landing, they're landing. Finally, here at the meeting point.
So I just keep running? Yes, don't sit down, just keep pushing forward. Okay, You're okay. You're gonna see the glider. Okay, tell me when to sit down or stop running like this. Oh my god, I'm nervous. Timo! Oh. oh my gosh! It's... So, what happened? one, two, three, forward. Now? Yeah. Keep pushing. Keep pushing. Ah! The mountain. We're gonna get near it. Ah. Three, two, <laughs> no. <one>. impact. <laughs> oh my goodness. A few moments later. You'll never catch me, crabs. Not when I shift into maximum overdrive. I'm alive! <laughs> Best thing ever! Okay, do it! Go! Hey guys, come flying paragliding with us! How was it? Really good! <laughs> Bye! Bye! <laughs> Hey guys, it's me. I'm back. Um, I just got home. Currently, it's around 11:54 p.m. So, di pa umabot ng 12 midnight. Then from the train station, tapat 4 a.m. yung yung train. But it was there really early, so we went there really early too. Tapos it was delayed for one hour. So I didn't make it to my next train, my connection train. And I also didn't make it to the alternative connection train. I had to get to another train and then transfer again. So, mga two transfers, which really took a long time. And I arrived at around 11 a.m. already instead of 9.30. Uh, but on the bright side, I was able to make it to my paragliding thing. And can I just say, like, I think this is one of the happiest days of my life because Aww. paragliding is really part of my bucket list and especially skydiving like initially i really wanted to skydive but yeah it, it was very expensive so i opted for paragliding and paragliding in switzerland this is something i kind of briefly mentioned after watching crash landing on you i manifested i was like i'm going to switzerland specifically interlochen i can't 
still wrap my head around the fact that I went paragliding alone in Switzerland. So I guess my tip for everyone talaga is to just tell the world the things that you want and it will come actually. Niyak ako. Because yeah, it's like really my dream. Like I'm I'm not afraid of heights. I really like extreme things. These are the things that I enjoy the most. So this is just an emotional moment for me. Like shout out to my parents. I this was a discussion I had with them. Na, they didn't want me to do it, and then eventually they allowed me to do it. Nalam. This is your sign to move to Switzerland, to make Epon for Switzerland, and just do it. Just do paragliding. It's really safe. Pilots, uh, they have been doing this for a really long time. It's super fun. You get to see the whole interlocking city because <laughs> it's really once in a lifetime I get I guess I couldn't be happier like I'm super happy so if you guys are interested you can go to paragliding interlocking GmbH they're one of the most established paragliding companies in interlock in Switzerland overall very happy with the, the service the everything like the people the the view especially and the excitement like you get to chill and then you get to do some roller coaster realness ikot ikot stuff and it ah so wrong saya like i can do it a hundred more times tbh but it's super mahal talaga yeah, that's it. If you have any comments, comment them down below. If you like this video, please do not forget to like, subscribe, and click the notification bell button to get notified every single time we upload a new vlog. Thank you guys so much, and I will see you in the next vlog.